Hello, you path experts. In this video, we will discuss about a requirement of the new project called a shop bookshop. So go to the here, navigate to the board's DNA, just click on the board, bookshop. So here the bookshop is, the, the thing is, they have the distributors, so they distribute the books, different type of books, and to the multiple bookshops. So they will get the number of sales, so basically monthly wise so we will get the previous month data so just you can download the previous month data so i'm just downloading this here so the robot has to download into the previous month data and it has to create let's let's open that monthly extract this one unzip unzip file so if you see this is a monthly data but it is not actually today's month this month Okay, so this is a previous month data. Okay. Every time, so when you download here, so that is a, they uploaded, when you click on the downloads, it will give the S previous month data. So right now we are in the January 2022 and it will give the uh, December 2021 uh, sales data. Okay. So if you go here, so these are all the shop names. Each text file is called as shop names. If you see the Vija, uh, Book Depot and Vikas, bookstore right if you open this any text file so this is a monthly sales report so here this is a pipe separated data the book name and number of books sale so this is a book names so whatever the books are this there is a common books are there okay this book how many they sell so so 653 they sell on the month of december 2020 one that is previous month if i have if we are in the february 2022 and if you download the the zip file so those data is that january 22 okay the previous month data so what we have to do so we have to collect each and every uh, shop and uh, this shop names so and we have to convert this into the excel but the excel format is it's a each book is like a one sheet because so it is only this book center is a uh, distributing distributing in the sense they are just uh, sending the books only these 10 books okay these these kind of books only not more than that okay so then we have to find how many books total monthly sale throughout the all the shops a life or two leaves Okay, the my truth. So, so my, if we take the my truth, so this is a, this many books in this shop, right? If you go to the another book center, my truth, this many number they sell, right? So you have to create an Excel consolidated Excel looks like this one, a sample output. If you see the sample output, having the all the sheet names is you have to create the robot has to create a, a new sheet for each and every it's not static they may increase the books uh, tomorrow okay so you just maintain the a, a dynamic kind of thing okay so each book if, if you open the text text file if you have a new book you have to create a, a text file if you do a, a new sheet in the excel if you're already having the sheet in the excel with the same book name then what you have to do you have to append that data into that particular book sheet so here you can see uh, the two three columns one is a shop name and number of books sold and shop names which text files so where is where you will get the shop name the text file name is called shop name here is a uh, saraswati book center right so ravi book center right so here the shop name is called a book uh, shop name uh, text file name is called shop name and number of sale you can find within the text file and month is always previous month okay always you take the previous month okay uh, take the current date and uh, so find out the previous month of that particular date and you can know sheet names right so this is a you have to prepare and you have to keep that particular text file uh, uh, CSV uh, Excel file in the separate output folder. So every month the robot has to run at the uh, fifth of because within the five days they will send us. So for fifth of every month is a, a due date, right? Before five, fifth month only they have to fifth, fifth day of each month they have to send all the report to this particular site, right? So they will send and it will convert into the zip file so you can download. So so. We're scheduling the board into the fifth of every month 
uh, our sixth, fifth, uh, fifth evening, and what will happen? So it will run every month once, and it has to consolidate all the text files from different shops and create a, a new Excel consolidated Excel report having the monthly. It has to create a December 2021.xlsx like that. So the, the other, other people, they will just simply, <clears throat> the, the business people, they will just simply, uh, instead of going each and every text file, they can simply go to the only one Excel sheet to calculate. So how many books sold uh, uh, for each uh, month throughout the <clears throat> shops thank you very much that is a uh, only one project once uh, once they uh, created so that excel so you have to keep into the out output and not only that so you have to upload here you have to upload here so click on this just i'm just clicking the invoice so just click on the uh, actually so the month month file right month file so if i create a month file like this like this, okay. So month file like this, you have to upload this one here every month, uh, okay. So fifth of the month, upload and click on the submit. So the, it's the submitted successfully, okay. So that is a one robot. So everything is a dummy data. So uh, it's not real data, just for your practice, we're creating the, we are creating uh, all these kind of things to practice RPA. So your RPA knowledge, hands-on experience you'll get here in bots DNA. A lot of projects are there. So please refer to the uh, this this uh, URL to the multiple people who are learning and uh, uh, lacking of the hands-on experience. So this will definitely helpful for them. Thank you very much for supporting me. Bye-bye.